Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to teach you how to play Parasol by Travis Scott. Um, and I believe Young Lean and uh, Dave Chappelle is also included in the song. And so it's going to be just three chords. Um, so it's going to be a C major 7, uh, a B minor 7, an A minor 7, and then you're going to go back to the C major 7. And uh, the way I'm going to teach you is with a capo on the first fret. You don't necessarily uh, actually need a capo, and I'll explain that later on in the video. But in terms of um, uh, how I'm going to teach you, capo on the first fret, and everything's relative to the capo. And this is how you play the chords. Okay, guys, so the first chord is a C major 7, and what we're going to do here is we're going to bar the third fret, and then it's going to be the fourth fret G string and the fifth fret uh, D and B string. It's going to sound like this. Okay, and the second chord is a B minor 7, and so we're going to bar the second fret. Then it's going to be the third fret B string and the, uh, the fourth fret D string. It's going to sound like this. And then halfway through when you play that chord, you're going to use your pinky and you're going to hit that high E string on the fifth fret. Um, you can clearly hear, hear it in the song. But um, it's something like this, right? Um, so just play the song back, and then you'll, you'll really understand what I'm talking about. But the, the third and the final chord that you need to know uh, is an A minor 7, and so that's going to be the first fret B string and the second fret D string. It's going to sound like this. And those are the chords that you need to know. When you piece it together, it'll sound like this. Okay. Um, and the way I did, the way I just strummed it is pretty much kind of the vibe of the song. It's re it's really a low key chill song. Again, like I always say in my videos. You can choose whatever strumming pattern that you want to do, um, depending on, you know, uh, what kind of vibe that you're going for. But if you want to keep it relaxed and chill, just kind of try to emulate what I just did there. Um, you can also pluck the strings. I like to just pluck them. It, it kind of gives it a more, uh, even more chill um, vibe, if you will, in, in my opinion. Um, so, yeah, but, you know, with the lyrics, it'll sound like this. Shading by the trees, looking through the glass, watching by the bushes, waiting on a breeze. You is all I need. So yeah, like cite that throughout the whole song. And in addition to that, the first chord that I taught you, the C major seven, you don't necessarily have to play it up here on the third fret. Um, if you don't want to use that bar chord then you can actually just play it down here. Um, so it would be the second fret um, D string and the third fret A string. It'll sound like this. So you can substitute this chord for, or this chord structure for the other C major uh, variation, okay? And there's a YouTube channel out there I believe the his name is B Martin Sounds. He he does a great job at explaining uh, this way of playing C major seven, and um, so yeah, you can do that. And also for those people that don't have a capo, you don't even necessarily need a capo for this song. And so um, what you're gonna do if you, if you don't have capo, the last chord that I taught you, the A minor seven, same same exact thing. Just use use your index finger to bar. The, f the first fret on the guitar, okay? So. That's all you need to do. Cool, so hey, I appreciate you guys watching, and if you feel like this added value to you, uh, please go ahead and like the video, leave a comment down below, and please consider subscribing. If you want more tutorials and content like this, 
and I will see you guys on the next video.